Ladies, welcome back to my channel. So today is my filming day and we about to put on some makeup. So what I normally do is wash my face and all this stuff I did, of course. And I just went in with my witch hazel and I'll take these little cotton rounds to get like the oil and stuff off of my face before I apply my makeup to make sure it sticks. But today I'm just going to do like a, just like a natural beat <laughs> because I will be wearing a main unit. So I do not see the sense of putting on eyeshadow and going through the motion. So first I'm going to go in with my Fix and Last Essence Jelly Primer Hydrating and Refreshing and I love this primer and I have an e.l.f. on as well but I've been using this y'all got so much makeup I hadn't used it's just pathetic so I'm just going to take a little squirt yeah. It's like a jelly pink color. So and I already did my eyebrows and stuff like <laughs> off camera. I say one day. <laughs> I will do an eyebrow tutorial because my eyebrow routine has changed. As you see, they look different. And they'll probably look different when I put on all of my makeup and all the other stuff that I got going on. But, <laughs> so, as for concealers, I like to use the Photo Focus Concealer by Wet n Wild. And trying to find my shade. The shade that I use to spot conceal is the 844B medium slash deep tan color. It's this color right here. And I also have this color in my hand just in case. Medium tiny. So I just want to put this on and spot conceal. I was gonna blend it in with my finger. That's what I normally do. Y'all better start using y'all fingers. Sometimes it's cool to, you know, use a makeup brush, but sometimes I don't like dirtying up my makeup brushes and stuff. And then I just wash my brushes last night <laughs> and I have to wash a few today. So we just gonna use the finger. And lately I've been just liking that natural look. Like I don't like all y'all see. <laughs> I'm pretty simple now. My makeup taste has changed a lot. I guess because I'm getting older, you know. So that could be it. But you know, it's gonna be giving natural. Okay, so foundation. The foundation that I will be using is the it's affordable, y'all. It's affordable. It is the Maybelline New York Fit Me and I'm shade 332, which is Golden Caramel. And I just recently got that, I think it's like a tan color as well that I used to get from Maybelline. I don't remember the name, but it's like a shade up. But this is my perfect shade match. And I will always have this. <laughs> well always so what I'm gonna do is this is like a just a regular foundation brush from Morphe that I had with their foundation whenever they came out with it and we're just gonna do that yeah I'm just showing you like the basics in this video and um the rest will be sped up a time lapse probably time lapse more than likely, but I just want to show y'all the basics, like the foundation and all that, you know, what I used to put on. So, 
stab it. I have oily skin, by the way, if I didn't mention it. I've always had oily skin, and it's always, I always had acne, acne prone. Um, <laughs> when I was younger, I had acne real bad under the chin, like really bad. But the only thing now is just my dark spots was just, you know, I'm not really tripping off of it. As long as I, it's not no acne. But when I do get acne and all this stuff, I use these little patches. My Peace Out. What's the name of it? Peace Out Skincare is what I use. And I got this from Sephora. There is another brand I'm going to try. It's available. I think. What's it? I don't know if it's. And Oxo, or whatever their brand is, but somebody got, <laughs> I wrote it down. Somebody had it made a little vlog or whatever, and I wrote it down, but they got some patches like this. It's probably like half the price, and I want to try it when I, um, when I run out. But y'all, let's see. Let's see. And this is that. Okay, so the next step would be powder foundation. Right, it is a Sephora Micro Smooth Powder. And yeah, I could just say Sephora. And I would be using just this e.l.f. powder brush to put it on. And y'all, Sephora brand in general, they got good eyeliner, good, uh, what, what do I like from I like they lip stains and stuff like this. It's real cute. But the whole line is bomb. So, if y'all ever wonder about Sephora, because you know how it is when you have like the, the brand name makeup and all this stuff you don't know how it is but it's good <laughs> it's better than um higher end makeup and even though i do have my own my own little brand i still get and try other makeup because i am a makeup junkie so you know I got so many lip glosses and lip liners. I mean, it don't matter if it's cute on me. I'm just gonna spray it with this Wet and Wild No Bad Days. This is a setting spray, setting mix hydrate. The concealer is gonna go under my eyes and all the other stuff. And then after this video, I'm just gonna speed up everything. Yeah, I see the end in their final outcome of my look. But I'm gonna go in with Wet n Wild, of course. And I'm gonna take the lightest color, I believe it's the lightest color I have. It's the light medium bag. I'm gonna get this bag stir -dry. I'm just gonna take this little wig. I'm not gonna wet it. Johnny's wet it. Nah, I ain't got no I'm just gonna blend it. Again, so how when I do my makeup? Okay, so let me speed it up. Mm. It even feels right. So, go ahead and just cut the bang. Let's see if you use this play music. 
This is how I ain't so.